Goggy fans, uh, my name's Chris Shaw, been a member here at Radnor off and on for the last 25 years, always come back. Um, this is my favourite hole, the 14th at Radnor. Now I'm not sure how much of me you can hear, it's uh, in true Cornish golf style, it's very very windy and rainy today. Uh, I'm squatting behind a bush. Um, so yeah, this is Radnor, if any of you don't know the course, uh, it's a very friendly, very tricky nine hole course in Scoria, um, but it has two sets of tees and the second set of tees really changes the hole. Um, this is the fifth hole, but the second time round, so it's the 14th. Um, where that chap down there is, is the normal tee, uh, playing off the mats at the moment. So that makes the hole about 160, 170 yards. But it's a bit of a all or nothing hole. If you're brave and go for the pin, it narrows and narrows and narrows down to that bowl you can see there. Um, if you're not brave or sensible, uh, you really should lay up here or just plop it down the middle like these guys have done. It's generally the safest option, then pitch it onto the green for an easy four. That big tree on the right there is where I normally go. If it's an interesting day, I can hook it onto the fourth tee over there. If I'm playing really well, I go too long and nearly kill people on the third. Now a bit of tradition, at least between me and my dad, when you come up here onto the hole, you always have to go over to the bench and pay your respects to the previous members. Some of our most well-known members have got their ashes scattered up here. Here we have Dave Reed, the first captain and first president of the course. Hi Dave, hi Reggie. All right boys, always come up and say hello before teeing off. So yeah, in proper um, Big Oggy style, uh, I'm gonna have a quick tee off in a minute. I've only brought one club with me because it's bloody wet. Um, we're not going to use a tee. We're not going to have a practice swing. I've not hit a ball in a fortnight. The wind is hard behind and from the left. So I'm expecting to go over there somewhere, but we shall see. The club we're going to be using for this hole is the Adams Tight Lies, uh, 19 degrees, I think. Yeah, pretty much an easier to hit free iron. Stiff shaft, my favorite club of all time. Uh, I'm absolutely thrilled that Adams are coming back after uh, TaylorMade bought them. Whoops. Now, I've no idea if the camera picked up that shot or not, but that might be the best shot I've ever played on this hole. Uh, straight as a die, just to the left of the green. I think it's probably gone down the path because it was a bit long, but the wind is behind. So yeah, as you approach the green, um, if you do lay up, you've got to be careful about this stuff on the left. Over here, we have a little bunker, which I've never actually been in. And then just behind it, where those little yellow stakes are, is a cheeky little, very deep pond. Um, yeah, which I've also never been in actually. So I don't tend to hit short, I tend to hit too far. And too left, or too right. So here is my tee shot, happy days. Uh, unfortunately, I don't only have the rescue club, so we're gonna be putting with this as well. I'm probably not gonna be able to film it, because I've got no tripod. We're gonna wing it. Right, well, I pressed the wrong button on the phone, so fortunately you didn't see me narrowly missing the one-handed par putt, but we did get a four, and we've only one club, so we're happy with that. It's a shame I'm not playing around. Right guys, thanks for watching. Um, thanks to Radnor for letting me out here without having to pay. Um, shout out to the Honourable Company in Hale, as I'm a member, and they will lynch me if I don't say anything. Um, cheers! A rare shot of one of the buccaneers there just going around onto the uh, fourth tee. <laughs> so what do we have here? We found a wild badger in the uh, in the wild. <laughs> yeah. yeah, just playing his tee shot on the fourth, or is it the thirteenth? So damn windy that ball won't even stay on the tee. Well, I didn't see it, but it went the right way. Lovely. Lovely. I'll take that, <laughs> used to say, many years ago. And with that, cheers and gone. See you later. <laughs>